Friday at pregame.com, and this is Johnny Detroit. And first things first, invent a Super Bowl prop contest is live going on in the pregame community, pregameforums.com. If you've ever sat there and said, hey, this would be a cool prop, this would be an interesting prop to have on the Super Bowl, well, now's your chance. Bet online from the offshore industry and the Cal Neva family of sports books in Nevada with 30 plus locations are participating. They will pick a prop from the forums. Check it out. It's under the NFL, posted by Mr. R.J. Bell. The rules and everything that is involved with going on with this is detailed in the post. And the best part is from Bet Online. If they choose your prop, they will put a thousand dollars in your account. Plus, use the prop that you created for all of their members to be able to bet. Same thing for the one in Vegas. There is no prize there, but you know what? A prize of having something you created, just a normal dude. A Super Bowl prop used in 30 plus locations throughout Nevada and sports books for people who are filling these sports books, betting on Super Bowl Sunday to see your prop on the board, your prop on the prop sheet. I think is pretty damn cool. So check it out. Um, one of the more interesting contests going on in the internet right now involving the Super Bowl. So I would definitely take a look at that. Over to the good, the bad, and the ugly. Shake and Bake is now 13 and 0 run. On college basketball totals, he went 2-0 yesterday to up his mark to 13-0. Marco goes 2-0. Lenny Del Genio has been red hot 4-0 yesterday for Lenny. King Creo, one play, big three-star winner. J.R. O'Donnell goes 2-0, including his three-star. Dave Essler wins four out of five. Vegas runner did lose his three-star on Wisconsin. But he won his other two two-dime selections, so a grinded-out profit for the day for VR. Gil and myself both dropped our three stars. I had William and Mary. They were plus eight, eight and a half, either tied or leading the whole game in the final two minutes. I have no idea what happened. And Andre Gomes had two plays yesterday. He loses both. So what am I looking at? First of all, the special for today, and this is going to go down late afternoon, Vegas runner three days, all of his plays Friday, all of his plays Saturday, all of his plays on Sunday. You get total access to Vegas Runner for a low discounted price. You definitely want to check that out. That includes all big selections and all sports. The Slash for Friday. I know Greg Shaker was on Tuesday, Wednesday, and Thursday, but due to the college basketball run, due to the demand, I'm getting the email of people with one asking questions, how does a human being have a dome that big? And where do you find a cowboy hat to put on a head that big? And any way you could extend the shaker discount. I'm going to extend it for Friday only. It's going to come down at midnight. Your last chance to get a 7 and 30 day package is discounted. Look at what he's selling his daily packages for. Look what you can get the 7 and 30 for. Look what you can get the 7 and 34 discounted today. And it makes the most economical sense for you to do. So who am I looking at first off? Granted, it's not in college basketball where he's had a 13-0 run. He has hit seven of his seven of his last eight triple stars. Greg Shaker has a big three-star going today in the NBA. And Steven Nover, 21-7 NBA run. He has his NBA Game of the Month going today. Over to the free selections, Larry Ness game 824. Portland Trailblazers over the Phoenix Suns. Larry has a monster analysis and write-up on this game that you could reach at pregamepros.com and in the right-hand nav, click free picks to read all of the detailed analysis from Larry. It's pretty intense. Also, Larry has a conference game of the month going, a total game of the month, and he is on an 11-0 run on his three-star game of the month selections. And last but not least, the tip from Johnny Detroit. If you are looking to get in the prop contest, BetOnline does not require a deposit. You just have to have to have an account because obviously they need to put the thousand bucks in there for you. But your best bet is to check out pregameaction.com. It's a partner that does business with pregame. They monitor sports books, and what they will do is if you sign up with one of their endorsed sports books, they will contact me, and they will fund your account with a hundred dollars in pregame dollars. So BetOnline is one of the recommended books. So if you're looking into the prop contest, you might as well sign up through them. So if down the road you happen to deposit, you get that free 100 bucks. It's a great deal. So from Johnny Detroit to you, I appreciate everyone watching. I'll be back on Saturday. Best of luck.